right, welcome back to Live at 9. In the house are some champions, but also the reason I wanted to bring in Braylon was because I saw that you're now a five-star recruit, and if yes, people sir. at home don't understand what that is, that is the best ranking you can possibly get. I, I know they rank them in order, but ultimately, if you have five stars next to your name, that means you're one of the top 25, 20 best high school football players in the country. That's when you true. hear that, what does that make you think? Um, it's just a blessing. Um, you know, if you would have told me year ago, years ago, that I would have been in this position, I probably wouldn't have, you know, I probably would have laughed and just went on about it. But now it's like I'm starting to see reality. Um, I'm starting to see world outside of Mississippi. Um, it's, it's good. It's different. When you think about some of the previous five stars that just come off the top of my head, Cam Akers, Suntarian Perkins, Raylan Womack. I mean, that, that's got to be pretty crazy to think about. I mean, think about those names. Branson Robinson went to Georgia. All these great names. And it's like, wow, he's standing there in your locker room at Hartfield Academy. Yeah, I mean, Bra but Braylon's Braylon, right? <laughs> I mean, it, you know, he's, he's had an extremely successful uh, football career as to date, and uh, he's reaping the benefits from it. But, man, it, it hadn't changed who he is, who he is to his friends, who he is to his coaches. Is the same guy, man, that, that we work, get to work with every day. Yeah, and what kind of keeps you humble then? Um, just knowing that at any given moment, God can take it away. That's a, that's a really interesting thought. We got your highlights up there right now. You can run it right at the camera. Uh, so talk about this past season. You guys won the championship. Obviously very dominant. I mean, you were catching touchdowns all over the place. It was pretty crazy. I mean, every game I went to, I knew you. I was going to get you on camera. Uh, talk about this past season and winning the championship. First one in uh, school history. Um, it was just, it was start off weird, you know. Everybody, um, we were supposed to get the playoffs taken away from us because, you know, things. But I just knew. We didn't do anything wrong. I knew that um, it kind of gave me that think, like, all right, maybe they see something in us that they don't, you know, they just don't want to play us or, you know, they just see something we don't. And everybody thought that was just going to break our team apart, but really it brought us real close, real close. I think it was, like, the, you know, closest team I've ever been on. Mm -hmm. um, not just our seniors stepping up, but our juniors, our sophomores, our freshmen even stepped up. Um, we just had people like MRA game. We had a sophomore come in for our, you know, arguably our best defensive player, Chris Jones, and he won defensive player of the week that week. Two wow. interceptions. Um, it's just like, you know, we lose one, we can have somebody replace it, and it's not, you know, in the talent at, at, athletic wise, but it's like in the heart. Like you have that heart of want to be a champion. And that's where it got us. Human nature is is when you're given things very early in life, you tend to go one specific direction. What do you try to do to keep him on the right path other than he's just doing the right thing just from the jump? I mean, you talk about motivation for the team, which was what happened prior to the season. How do you keep him motivated to say, hey, you're a five-star recruit. We just won the championship. But trust me, trust me, there's more. Yeah, I, I think the thing that Braylon has done a very good job of is, is he surrounds himself with the right kind of people. Uh, Braylon is, is a trusting guy, so the guys that he's close to, whether it's his, his coaching staff, his parents, you know, Demario Davis, some of those people that are around him are speaking the right things into his life. And so Braylon, like, like I said, he's, he's pretty easy to coach in that sense. I don't have to keep him motivated. He wants to win. He's a high competitor, but he wants his teammates to play at a very high level. We just got back from Arkansas team camp, and, uh, you know, he's pulling guys to the side, telling them to step up. We're trying to, you know, we're tired, we're hot, and we want to keep playing. And so, I mean, he, he, I don't have to motivate him. He, he, he's pretty self-motivated. Uh, you were watching all those highlights, I weren't was. you? <laughs> I was, was, I was so just funny. looking at a couple you know, of I'm, I'm listening to Coach. I, I, I look over here, and he is just locked into those highlights. Ooh, pretty good camera work by WJTV, it was, right? I it mean, was. I, might, I might have to send you those when you're an NFL might player and just be like, hey, because I, I did that for some of the guys that just got drafted. I, I, I posted some high school clips of them five, yeah. six years ago, and it's like, oh, well, maybe, you know, when it's time for you, you know, I'll post those. Especially that one right there. That, <laughs> one, that was the first. That was the first uh, touchdown state championship game. That yeah. one was like, I, I almost dropped it. He didn't know that. <laughs> ball, I had my hands out. The ball was right there. And I just closed my arms. But like that was like, you know, when you catch the ball, you score. All the goosebumps, the butterflies just went away. And when I saw you pointing at me, and I saw you, you know, everybody was hyped. I was like, all right, we're still in. All right, coach, let's see that ring real quick. Just put put it right there. Look at this. Let's, yeah, there you go. There's the ring. All right, we got about 20 seconds, so this got to be really quick. What are some of the three schools that you kind of like right now that you kind of been, or are you allowed to say? 
<laughs> you, okay, sorry. No, I, I don't want any schools because because they, they'll because they'll watch this. Yeah, they, they will, but um, you don't have to. I don't want to put you on the spot. I, don't, I, don't, I can't give you three. How many um, can you give me? All I can say is okay. There will be eight schools drop soon, possibly before the season. Um, my top eight schools I'll be dropping. I, I any want, Mississippi ones? I don't okay. want to give you names. Thank you, thank you so much for joining us today, Coach. Thank you so much, Braylon. Good luck this season, and you know we'll be there throughout this season. Yes, sir. All right. We'll